Got a question the other day, should I swing a heavy bat or a light bat? You know what, I think it's all about bat speed. I think the heavier the bat is, if you got good bat speed, that's great. But I know when I was playing, I swung a B267, 35, 32 cupped. And it was a monster, it was a thick handle, felt I had bat speed. Later on in my career, I had sh shoulder surgery on my left shoulder labrum and I rehabs and I dropped down to a 33 and a half, 31 cup R161, still a thick bat, still had some, some girth to the head, had balance with a thicker handle. And in hindsight, I wish I was swinging that my whole career, right? Because this is about bat speed, man, right? I mean, obviously you can't have too light a bat where it's gonna break every time you hit it, but you know what? The way bats are made now, I mean, just get a bat that has balance, right? Everybody wants to swing the C243, the top heavy bat, because you might hit it a little bit further. Man, get something that you can control. Like this right here is an R161, 33 and a half, uh, 31 ounce, and I feel like it's a weapon. I had bat speed every single day, right? And if you, there's no worse feeling than having no bat speed, because what happens then? Now we got fast feet and slow hands, right? And like you guys have heard me say all, my whole life is hitting a slow feet, fast hands, quiet head, taking a controlled, violent swing. And that's what hitting is, man. You got no bat speed, bro. It is not a good feeling. Swing a bat that you have good bat speed.